one of you guys asked me if I treat slipped discs. So discs don't really actually slip. What they actually do is they bulge or herniate, or protrude, right? So bone, disc bone, the disc can't slip out. It's attached with fibers, but it can compress and cause a disc to bulge and herniate and cause lots of pain and alleys. And so what happens when that occurs, first of all, what an x-ray actually looks like is this when it does quote unquote slip. You can see this person here, they have significant amount of compression on the discs. And there's not a whole lot of space. So that disc there is compressed, it's bulged, it's herniated, and it's compressing and it's pushing onto the nerve roots. And what's happening is it's causing this person to have some significant pain and they're hurting in their neck and down their arm. So the treatment is designed to slowly pull that pressure off the disc, off of the nerve, get that water oxygen nutrients in there so that the disc is no longer quote unquote slipped, compressed and hurting, and you can start feeling much better.